Hey guys, and welcome back to some more Naruto to Boruto, Shinobi Striker. Man, it's been a long time since I've said that. We've been on a bit of a break from the game, if you haven't realized, like, it's literally been over a month since I last uploaded a video for Shinobi Striker. Um, yeah, I've just taken a bit of a break for the game, I was just a little bit pretty bored of it, to be honest, even with the uh, Konohamaru DLC, it just wasn't interesting enough to me and this has probably been the longest break I've had on the game for a, a very long time. So the year is slowly coming to an end as we all know. Man, this year has gone by so damn fast. We are currently still on season 5 for Shinobi Striker and uh, we're expecting to see two more characters releasing. I believe there's just going to be one character releasing uh, this year and then next year we're going to be getting uh, the other character. I'm pretty sure Ishiki is coming out first. And then we're getting, um, we're getting, uh, Baryon Mode Naruto next year in January. Now, um, I kind of, like, think that this could be it. Season 5 could be the last DLC for Shinobi Striker. Um, it just kind of really makes sense. If you didn't know this, there's actually a, uh, like a Naruto event happening, uh, next month in December. So, I think, like, I think it's at a Jump Festa festival or something like that, I believe I read, and yeah, we're going to be getting some new news about the Naruto franchise, and for sure, for sure, there's going to be some sort of announcement about a brand new Naruto game. Now, if that does happen, or eventually will happen, Shinobi Striker is going to be completely dead. There's no way they're going to bring, be bringing out brand new DLC if there's going to be a new Naruto game uh, being in the works or even being released for that matter. We, you, if we're lucky, we could get a final season 6 DLC and then a brand new game releasing at the end of 2023. But yeah, who knows? This, this could be it. This could be the final season for Shinobi Striker. Also, if you didn't notice as well, the game is actually going to be free all the way until October of next year. If you're a PlayStation Plus member, the game will be available on the PS catalog. So, I don't know, to me that just kind of suggests that there is no new content content in the works. So, they're just releasing the game for free for everyone to get if you're a PS Plus member. So you can get and play the game and therefore potentially um, they're going to be making money somehow. People going ahead and buying all the current DLCs that are out. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. That's kind of my opinions and thoughts on this that season 5 could be the final DLC, especially if we are going to be getting a brand new Naruto game. Now when it comes to Naruto and like a brand new game, there is a lot of speculation that we'll be getting a brand new Storm game, Naruto Storm 5. Now this does sound pretty exciting, but in my opinion, I reckon it's going to be something completely brand new. A brand new kind of Naruto style game that maybe we haven't seen before. I've said this in multiple videos that I would love to see a Naruto game set up just like Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. I reckon that would be spectacular, like an open world kind of free roam experience, but within the Naruto franchise and series, it's being able to explore villages. Pretty much exactly like Kakarot, but just just a Naruto story. I reckon that would be really cool. And if that would potentially going to be a, a game to releasing, I would definitely be buying it. And I'm sure a lot of other people as well. So yeah, um, I would really like to see that over a Storm 5. But yeah, as I said, we have to just wait and see. That event will be happening um, sometime in December. So definitely keep an eye out. And if I hear any news, I'll definitely be making a video about it. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. So thanks for tuning in to a, another video. I really appreciate all the support. I don't know if I'm going to get back into playing Shinobi Striker regularly again. Just kind of still a little bit bored of it, to be honest. So yeah, if, if, if nothing interesting really does come out, then um, I'm definitely not going to be playing it as much regularly as I used to. But when the DLC does drop, we will definitely be checking that as well out as well. Um, yeah, they're just going to do something to keep me interested. And I know a lot of other Shinobi Striker content creators are kind of feeling the same way. But um, other than that, guys, thanks for watching. I'll let the rest of this video play out. Take care, and I will see you all in the next one.